Good morning and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In case you're new here, this is Muhiri Ann and in this channel I do home making videos that is I clean, cook and also a bit of lifestyle videos. So welcome and feel at home. So in today's in today's video guys, I'm just going to be walking you through what I do in the morning uh, here in the village. That is kind of a morning routine here in the village. So stay tuned until the end of this video. Make sure you like, subscribe and also do leave a comment for me and more importantly don't forget to put the notification bell on in case of any new video you'll be amongst those people who will get the notification yeah so stick around guys until the end of this video and i'm um, just started by um washing my face that is what you normally do in here in the village and then after that i'll be cleaning this a uh, house of uh, uh cows this is where our cows do sleep so we normally clean it each and every day because we don't want them to sleep in a very, very dirty place. So the first thing we do is to clean the place and make sure it's uh, all uh, clean. Yeah. And you guys before i actually forget i am here today to remind you to actually follow me on my other social media handles that's on instagram facebook and also on tiktok and i'm going to be showing you how to do that so so guys just go to your phone and then to your youtube app that is what i'm showing you right now and then there you can just go to my channel in if you are already a subscriber and if you are not please subscribe and then up there you just click and go to my uh, description yeah the description is a uh, well uh, short and uh, clear it's uh, make home making motherhood cleaning and also lifestyle to support my channel you please subscribe like share and also comment extended support you send pesa and also paper so down here i have the links for instagram tiktok facebook yeah so if you want to follow me there please guys do so and uh, if you have any query that you want to ask me you are actually free to do that on those social social media handles i've seen most of you asking me questions in the comment section uh, sometimes i don't feel like comfortably answering you those questions there because uh, we can't be uh, like doing like a conversation in the comment section so if you have anything that you want to ask me please do so in those uh, social media handles and i'll be glad to uh, get back to you guys also i want to clean this uh, place as well it's the entryway and uh, most of the time chickens do sleep here we don't keep them in the house 
Sometimes if they sleep in the house, you will wake up and find it smelling so bad. So I prefer them to sleep outside here. So uh, this place being the entryway, I have to make sure it's always clean. I do sweep it always, guys. Like always, yeah. So the chickens sleep at this far corner, you will see that. So I just want to make sure it's clean and uh, before actually it's a daytime, yeah. You know, uh, when you are at home, people just come to your homes. So like here in the Shago, people don't need to be invited to come to, to your house. So they'll just, they will just appear. Yeah, so and I don't want them to find this home a dirty. To my new subscribers welcome 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 you guys and feel at home it feels nice to have a new member in the room uh, yeah i love love visitors welcome please and feel at home do invite your aunties uncles uh, cousins sisters to subscribe to this channel it's actually 2023 and i'm sure i'm not going to be disappointing you with content it's just going to be amazing yeah yeah so Please subscribe and also do remind others to do so. To my returning subscribers, thank you so much guys for always subscribing. I really, really appreciate that and I can't take it for granted. And to my premium gang, you are all I need guys. I really, really appreciate your support and I can't honestly take that for granted. Thank you so much for always being here for me. So let's enjoy the content guys. I'm done sweeping and now it's time to wash the utensils. Actually, here in the village, the morning routine is actually uh, the same same one that we do in town. But here, it's a bit mm, enjoyable because the space is so free. As you can see where I'm washing the utensils, the space is so free. And I'm washing while uh, doing actually basking. So, yeah. so, stay tuned, guys. So watch until the end and also like the video if you already love it. What you're actually seeing in front of you guys is a table but very very important here in the village it serves us as a dish rack and i love it a lot because do you know what it it dries up the utensils very very fast and uh, very well and uh, yeah and it's just a natural way of drying up the utensils here in the village so you just wash put them there to dry and then use that is it guys it's just as simple as that so that's why i've told you here in the village i'm just enjoying this just freedom it's just full of freedom here
so guys just let me know in the comment section how is your morning routine kind of from your village because i know most of the people they will wake up go to the shamba and also go to the river to fetch some water i honestly wanted to do that but but uh, for the shamba it's uh the maize are already there so it, it's almost time to harvest and for the river i wanted to go there but it's a bit far so i'll have to use these uh bohol ones but we don't do it for drink to drink we do it for house cause only because it's salt one yeah so we don't do salt water to drink yeah so just let me know in the comment section guys how is your morning routine from your village and i really really want to know are those village village vlogs from your places are we back to the star i can play the game but i'm falling again no don't hold back take it far promise you the same let the pleasure begin how about you come in closer we can do my place maybe we So again guys I just want to know how you scrub your sprayers uh, from your village how do you make them shine because for us we do sand uh, that is uh, the rough rough sand soil that we do or sometimes the jeep one the yeah I know you understand what I'm saying so just let me know in the comment section we don't do a steel wire because here in the village people do believe some things that steel wire maybe can bring some diseases like cancer and stuff so like my mom-in-law she's the, uh, one of the believer in that so she does she don't do steel wire and uh just let me know in the comment section guys how do you shine your sprayers back in the village and uh, here even if we do sand or jiv it's they still shines guys just let's see that i'm right now i'm doing sandy i'm doing sand soil and it's so so shining them so well yeah so let's interact there guys let me know in the comment section how you do that So just a quick one for those who went uh, home actually guys, I mean you shall go. How was life there like in terms of finance uh, for us we came home and let me tell you guys I am broke right now like as I am washing these utensils I have no money like in the village I don't know how it happens. You spend a lot like the money will just go and you don't have to bring anything like I don't know how it happens here in the village. People get really broke and we know, you know, we are in January and being in January without money is kind of hectic. So just let me know in the comment section, guys, how you survive there in the village. Because here in the village, when you come, the aunties be like, Nibaya Sukari, the, 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 the uncles, Nibaya Sbichai, and see at stuffs. Yeah, you buy, you buy, you buy. You just, you're just buying. You're just buying, and nobody's just buying for you. You're only buying, and buying, and buying. And then you remain broke. And you, even if you still remain broke, nobody will believe that you are actually broke. So guys, let me know in the comment section how you handle those aunties, and also uncles, and also shoshos. The grandmoms from your shago because they always all they want is to be is things to be bought for them You're breaking down my walls again.
I'm actually almost done with this uh, morning routine of mine, guys. So now I'm preparing the firewoods so they can go and cook breakfast for my family. So if you've watched this video up to this point, guys, thank you so much. Make sure you like, subscribe, and also do leave a comment for me. And please do watch until the end. So I'm starting preparing the breakfast by warming our special porridge from our local language. It's called bosara. That not bosa guys. I know you are going to think it's bosa but not that. It's bosara from our local language. I will be showing you in a different uh, video how we make it. And then I'll be roasting this maize for for them to use uh, to with that bosara. That is what I'll be doing. And then I'll be uh, also making a tea because we can't actually take posara alone. So we will be making this and also doing a posara. You guys here in the village, people eat a lot. They eat it a lot. So that is uh, the language of being in Ushago. It's so much windy today guys so I'm even struggling to to cook you can see that from the fire you know when it, there is too much wind around the fire will have to to just move move around like you don't cook comfortably but I'm no I'm sure I'm going to be trying and make sure I make these guys So guys, if you've watched this video up to this point, thank you, thank you so much for your support. Allow me to end it here and let me see you in my next video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share and also do leave a comment for me uh, down below guys. Bye bye and let me see you in my next video. Bye, love you and may God bless you for me.